and that is always on rapid fire rapid shot suppressing fire that should help me out quite a bit I would think stop getting caught in the web only losers get caught in the web and me once but that was a fluke what did I just say huh jeez I didn't go this way right nope because there's the little boy so let's drop another save and head in here and hopefully I don't have to kill this little boy how you doing Mummy? Mummy, no matter, son. Nope, she's dead. Calm down. Tell me who you are, child. Mummy! 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 She's dead. This is pointless. Just shut up. I don't think he understood me no matter what I said. So there's no point in me being a dick to him, really, because he, he didn't understand. Holy crap, this is going to be a lot... All right, uh, let's move. Jeez, where can I move? Um, we're no, we're just going to attack then, and I'm just gonna have to be surrounded for this. That is not what I wanted to do. And you're already targeting him, so go for him in his grasp. Holy crap! Mind blast, please. Thank you. What is dead? Just one thing is dead? Then start hitting things until they are dead. Make them dead. You are paralyzed. He is paralyzed, apparently. No, hit this guy. Why aren't you doing suppressing fire? Okay, um, I think he's dead. I think we got another one. So now our next target is, sure, that guy. Why not that guy? He's there, so why not focus on him? Hit him with some good stuff here. And a winner's grasp on this guy. So it should be enough to finish him off. Holy crap. We need to heal Stan. Stan, don't die on me. Okay, down he goes again. We don't have a mind blast even close to ready yet. Who is our next target? It is... No, we're gonna go for this guy. Because he is closer to my tanks, who I need to start, you know, conserving here. We need them to live. If we can let them. Yeah, you're gonna have to heal yourself, I think, because... Yeah, nothing else is ready. So, heal yourself there, Stan. Alright, we got another one down, and Morgan has leveled up. Hooray! Doesn't reset her spells, though, which is what I really was hoping for. Uh, these are regular skeletons. Hit the shambling skeleton here, and we can then work... You know, we're, we're going to go for the upgrades first, I think is what I'm going to do. Yeah, he's in the middle of drinking, and he's fine. He'll be fine with that. And then hit him with that, and... Hit, no, this guy. We're hitting that guy. Wait, you got blocked? What does that even mean? It said that it just said blocked. Come on, finish it, finish it, and he'll stand again. Okay, next target. This guy. Okay, I think that's a special skeleton there. Okay, we're gonna go. Yeah, shambling skeleton. So we're gonna go for this guy next. Hit him with pummel strike and an overpower on this guy because this is our target right here. You do have... Yeah. We're, we're doing decently. Po possibly. You probably need to heal. God, this is a cheesy fight. It's just so many enemies at once. Okay. Uh, oops. No! Damn it! I hit the wrong button out of habit! And down he goes. Okay, you cannot turn that on yet. We're going to hit this guy because this is the only uh, special guy left. No, hit him and winner's grasp him. Oh, they have shield back on. That's what's going on here. I was trying to figure out why he kept on getting hit. Okay, we're hitting this guy next. Hit him with that. 
and an overpower, and a lightning, uh, yes, we're still hitting this guy. And you need to turn this on. Come on, we can do this without healing again. Hit, uh, this guy. Because you guys have a little bit of a surround on him. And... Yeah, we'll just regular attack. You probably should use abilities still, though. And down he goes, everybody. Yep. Now down he goes. Now everybody focus on him. And you don't have anything prepped, so just attack him. And we should be good. We should be good here. Why is he focusing on Charles? Either way, down he goes. Let me start looting here. Poultice I can get back. Lessers, though. I'm hoping for regulars by this point. Regulars are most appreciated because that's what I used because that's what my tanks are on. Now, can I grab anything else out of here? This is crappy. That is that is no good. So we're just gonna head out of here. What the hell is all this? Charred corpse. Why not? Come on, sweet. Small shield that I don't care about. We'll just we'll just move on then. And head on to the other side where hopefully there's something good in the sarcophagus. It is the sarcophagus, a fancy scroll which is a gift and a tablet which gives me a codex as I assume and, and a new quest what is this quest the elven ritual it's perhaps elven you would think that Charles would be able to read it most of the lettering is faded making it indecipherable there are numerous pictographs however which seem to indicate some kind of cleansing ritual to perform prior to honoring the dead the first pictograph depicts a fill earthen jar being placed on an altar. The second shows an elf kneeling before the altar and praying. The third shows an elf taking a single sip of water from the jug. The fourth so shows the elf emptying the remainder of the jug into a pool. The last shows an elaborate doorway, perhaps opening or closing. It is unclear which. Interesting. Are these the earthen jars? Like this right here? That looks earthen to me. Looks like it's made out of clay or something like that. Oh! Level up. That is right. Magic, please. Magic and willpower. That's pretty much all that she needs right now. Hopefully. Hopefully. What kind of... Arcane bolts. Dealing moderate spirit damage. That's... That's good, I guess. You got anything else that's better? Shock? Dealing all... Yeah. So, it's a surrounding... No. I mean... I probably should start considering getting an AOE thing here, but I don't know. I don't really feel like it's necessary. I probably should get more healing as well. There's so many things that I want to get done with uh, with mages, but to be honest, I'm probably going to try to keep her as an all-around mage, like a red mage, until I can get a pure tank, and then I can replace... I don't know. Whoever's better. I, I have a feeling that Sten is probably my worst uh, character right now, so I might change him out once Alistair is good enough to become a pure tank on his own. No, this looks that great. So I'm going to go with Arcane Bolt here. Uh, yeah, shoot. No, no. Flame Blast. Oh, that was awful. I'm not doing that. Yeah, nothing else that great. So, uh, Arcane Bolt it is. Mage builds I am very iffy on. Very iffy. So we're going to go with that, which has now filled up her thing. Hooray. Uh, this is going to be... There. There we go. That looks good. So let's move on. Let's drop another save, just in case there be dragons on the other side of, her, of whatever is on that door. More earthenware jars. That is not what I was thinking. That... That would be a giant room. What is over here? Oh. Let's go into the giant room because there be enemies that way. And I don't see any enemies this way. This is... Yes, it's another giant room. What's down here at the bottom? A fountain. 
Oh, is this where they want me to do the quest? The water in the pool appears cool and clean. It is refreshed from some internal source, perhaps magically. Submerged in the water is what appears to be a small earthen jug. Okay, take the jug. You take the jug out of the pool. It's made of clay and appears to be none the worse for its long submersion. Um, drink some of the water? The water is surprisingly refreshing, but otherwise has no special effects. I'm trying to remember what the steps were here. Uh, okay, fill the earthen jug with water. You dip the jug in the water until it fills up completely. I think I was supposed to do that first. Drink some of the water. And then dump the water back into the pool. Slowly you spill the water out of the jug so it splashes back in the pool and nothing happens. Okay, let's leave the pool alone and let's... Wait, items received. What? Is that still the fancy scroll? Yeah, okay. So, what was the quest again? Elven ritual. Being placed on an altar. The kneel and praying. Single sip from the jug. Emptying the remainder. Okay. Okay, let's try this again. I swore I did that in order. Fill it with water. Drink some of it. You know, it's it says the same things. Dump it back in. Nothing happens. Leave the pool alone. And put it back into the pool. And leave the pool alone. And I... Feels like I, I did that right. Okay. Filled earth being placed on an altar. Kneeling before and praying. Taking a single sip of water from the jug. Shows... Yeah. Pouring it. And then... Opening the door. Okay, let's try this again. Forgot about the door part. Okay. Take the jug. Fill it with water. Take a sip. And hopefully I got this right. Dump it back into the pool. It's only like four or five steps. I should be able to get this. Nothing happens. Leave the pool alone. Open the door. I'm off. That's what it said to do. That is clearly what it's... Oh. Eh. I forgot about the altar. Okay. There, the, I thought this was the altar. Okay, we got this now. We got this. Uh... Fill it with water. Now we leave the pool alone. We go to the altar. The altar is plain and covered in a thin layer of dust. Numerous carvings cover its surface, but most are eroded beyond legibility. Place it on top of the altar. Kneel before the altar and pray. You kneel before the altar and pray, touching your forehead to the ground as depicted on the tablet. You feel a sense of rightness and approval around you. I did not put anything. I didn't put my forehead on the ground. I'm not. I, I don't do that. Uh. Then, examine the earthen jug. It's currently filled with water. Take a single sip. You carefully take a sip from the water in the jug, then replace it on the altar. Then we need to take the jug. You take the earthen jug, nothing is on the altar now, and we leave the altar alone. And now we pour this back in here. 
dump the water back into the pool. So you spill the water out of the jug in the pool. As soon as the jug is empty, it suddenly shatters the pieces falling into the pool. And the door has opened, and we have completed the quest. So let's drop another save, because I have a feeling I'm going to have to fight something over here. I see something. It's a shade. That definitely usually means I have to fight it. Definitely, usually. That is definitely a unit of surety. Just like a unit of understanding. Definitely, probably, definitely, usually. Private documents. Inventory full. Ugh. That can go away for now. We'll just get rid of those the iron rings. And we can take that. I don't know what I need to do with the private documents, but I'll hold on to them. Jeez. Well, all right then. What the hell? Was that me talking? Uh, okay. Skeleton archers. Not that tough. There's just two of them. Speak. Begin the onslaught. Now this should be fun. And down it goes. Right. Hit this guy. Everybody's on this guy, including Morgan. Including Morgan. Let's finish this. And down it goes. Come on, finish him off. Down he goes. Long sword with nothing particularly good on it. Sarcophagus with a slow rune. You can pick up a rune still. That is always nice. I'm not sure if it's a weight thing, the, the inventory limit, or if it's a number of items, to be honest with you. Okay, heading up here. H how you doing? Uh, no thanks, you're not my type. He, he was over there. Be gone, creature, you have no place here. I don't know what you're doing. Oh, shit. That probably wasn't the right answer then. Okay, shade, greater shade. Should I go for the greater shade then first? Because it's greater. That that usually means it's tougher. Now, yeah, I still have all that set. We're going to go for five. You're going to go for seven. And you're going to go for five. All right, oh, shit, there's a few of them. Chain lightning. Oh shit. That is a strong ass ability. I should focus on her. Holy crap, he's almost dead. Do not die, James. Wait, die almost? No. Charles! <gasps> what the hell am I doing? Oh, it has been a while. What the hell was that? I don't I don't know what you're talking about. I totally didn't almost say that. Let's head over here and take this guy. This shade on. What am I doing? I can't speak today. Oh don't die. No, don't die. Please don't die. Hit it with a shield pummel. You hit it with something. Who's getting hit? You are getting hit, so heal yourself. And you can use an arcane bolt. Nope, we're we're still we're still attacking this one. Still attacking that one. And you can't do anything. Come on, down goes the shade. You need to heal Sten now, and you guys all need to attack this greater shade here, who I should be able to finish off. Did I not tell you to attack yet? Hit him, hit him, hit him good. And you're still healing. Okay, good, good. There we go. Now we can do something else. Lightning is always nice. Shield bash. It can't stun a greater... No, we did! We did! Oh, you guys all missed. That was supposed to be it. Fine. Winner's Grasp, Overpower, and Sunder Arms. Why not? And down it goes. Down it goes. What do I get out of this quest here? What did I get? Pile of Bones. Splint mail, no good. Elven burial chamber. Right. Juggernaut plate armor. Holy crap! 
I do want that, but my inventory is full. And I got a new codex. At, uh, about creatures. Okay. Probably about the shade that I just killed. So let me clear up uh, some room here and I'll be right back. 